What's up my shuggies? Ashley here and in today's video I have an amazing video that I am so excited to bring to you guys. I've been waiting so long for this day and it is finally here. As many of you know I love anything to do with organization. It's probably my type A OCD personality. With that being said I am bringing to you a kitchen organization and complete pantry makeover video that is going to blow your mind. That's right a complete from start to finish pantry makeover so for all of my girls and guys that love some organization especially in the kitchen I have everything from building it to organizing it aesthetics and all of the good stuff in between so if you are interested in seeing this kitchen organization and pantry makeover video then just keep watching <laughs> Before we get into the video, I would like to thank Skillshare for sponsoring this video. As many of you know, I love Skillshare. Skillshare is an online learning community to deepen your skills and explore your creative passions. They have tons of classes to choose from, such as graphic design and creative writing. They also are always adding new classes to the mix, so there is always something new to choose from. I am looking forward to the new class that is launched about self-care and it is taught by Jonathan Van Ness. Skillshare is curated specifically for learning, meaning there are no ads and they're always launching new premium classes so you can stay focused and follow wherever your creativity takes you. The first 1,000 of my subscribers to click the link in the description box will get a free one month trial so you can explore your creativity. And without further ado, let's go ahead and get right into the video.
All right, you guys, here is almost the finished product, but I wanted to go ahead and show you guys what we have incorporated so far. So as you can see, the overall theme is going to be a little bit of wood and white and glass accessories. Um, I've tried to incorporate as much as I could from their pre-existing collection, and I still have some that I'm going to finish, including this spice rack. So I ordered some glass jars and then of course we'll get some sort of a riser for those to go on and as well as some bottles to store the oil in. And I think there were a couple of other things that I got just to complete this, but I will start from the side and kind of work my way up. So my idea was to incorporate things that they utilize not so often on the bottom and then working our way up. So we have a ton of paper towel, water, garbage bags. Again, I'm going to get a different um, kind of what I have at my house to put the garbage bags in that will um, make them a little bit more obscure. And then drinks and water. And then moving our way up in this basket, we have a bunch of cloths. Um, they utilize them a lot in the kitchen and these baskets, which are my absolute favorite. It is the most beautiful wood tone color with the raffita and the wicker accents. Um, there were only a couple of these, but if I ever find more, I'm going to get them. So storing some boxes in here and then some Marsala and organic olive oil. And then these, you know, I love these. They have them absolutely everywhere. They are the clear and bamboo storage containers. And then these they actually use to serve like dinner and stuff on. So I thought that that worked perfect in the corner. And then over here with just your um, generic storage stuff, baggies, all of that. Again, we can get more organized with that later on. This, I use the same concept that I did at my house. I love these. They are from the Bullseye Playground section at Target to store napkins and plates in, and then their cups. And then in here we have two different Lazy Susans to store um, extra bottles of stuff and stuff that they use all the time, like sprays. And then this is going to grow. It's gonna be like a pasta section. So a couple of different sizes of these to store pasta. And then this, which is a really great find from the bullseye section as well. This is actually a makeup organizer, but I love the clear and white aesthetic that it came with. And this, I stored um, a ton of their different packets that they had. And then back here, I have um, like vanilla extract. Um, cupcake wrappers and toothpicks so if you are looking for something to store some of your items upright in your kitchen i will see if i can link this below for you guys it's very similar to the tea organizer that i found at home goods but it was literally only like five bucks so really love that and then moving over here we have all of the bakery goods so flour sugar brown sugar that sort of thing and then like i said the spices are going to go here the tiered um organizer should basically go almost the entire width um, from left to right and then they are clear baby glass dispensers probably about the same size if not a little bit bigger and then they just have a, um, a little bit of a different top and then I'm going to put them on a wood um, organizer riser. Same thing with this. I'll either put them on something wood or clear. This is just something that I had extra to store their cans on. This basket is just everything literally extra that they have. Um, moving over here, this is the snack drawer. This is the one that I love. And if I can find another one to match over here, it would be perfect for just snacks. And then this is the candy section. So again, going to add a couple of more. This is just the essentials for now. And then up here, as you can see, I used um, and tried to use a couple of different types of cutting boards to display. Um, she had a nice little collection of pictures um, and carafes, so I put them up there. And then this is for coffee as well. Just super pretty and aesthetically pleasing. And then this is just stored with some steak knives. So... This top area is a little bit more for just kind of like the storage and aesthetics. These baskets, which I love from Target, really hide um, medicine. And then in this one, there is coffee. And then in here, again, more aesthetics. They have some bowls. And then here, I believe they actually store some of their teas. Um, and then at the very top, again, just more of that servingware storage, which again, we have 
tons to fill up. I need to get some sort of a display for um, the cookbooks and such, but as you can see, it really is coming together. I really, really love the way that it turned out. Very nice and high-end looking. So if you're looking into doing something like this, I hope that you guys enjoy this and can share some of these ideas if you are doing something like this in your home. Now for this organization, I love using these shelves to kind of double your space. Um, if you have a ton of cookware, bowls, that sort of thing to store and you want to double your space, these are really good. I think this one in specific is from Target, so I will see if I can link this below for you guys. Um, they also have the ones that actually attach to the bottom that you can pull out as a drawer. But because this is all um, nothing but baking goods and bowls and stuff, I thought that the shelf worked more appropriately in here. So I wanted to show that as one of the kitchen organization items that I love and utilize all the time. In this drawer, I believe I have shown this before. I really love it though and actually utilize the same exact thing in my kitchen and it is for storing your pan lids. I think it's aesthetically pleasing and is a really good, nice way to organize them. Super inexpensive. This one is nothing but um, cookware and again, this shelf really helps with the organization so you really can see what you have because like I've said before if you can't see it then you can't use it so tons of storage in these cabinets but again this just kind of helps alleviate a little bit of the clutter and keep everything nice and organized. And then in here, something very similar, except this is more upright for storing your throwaway pans, your cutting boards, your baking sheets, any of that stuff. If you have a deeper cabinet um, or even a longer one that has a little bit of depth, this is perfect for that. Um, Again, you'd probably have to have a wider opening if you're gonna do it uh, east to west, but I really love. This is something that I have in my home and I use it for the exact same thing, except I have, I believe my cast iron skillet on the end of mine. So really, really useful. Again, helps keep everything organized and visually easier for you to see so that if you are looking for something, it's easy to find. And last but not least, under the sink storage, this is one of my favorites. I have been utilizing this for quite some time now, and I love it. It's using that same exact pop top um, storage container that you would use for, you know, your candy flour, that sort of thing. But putting in your dishwashing little pods, um, again, it helps you know exactly how much you have left, and it helps keep everything organized. <laughs> And of course, aesthetically pleasing. Um, they opted to keep their paper towel underneath. And then I just added in these two bins from Target to store all of their um, sprays and stuff upright. And then the things that they use the most, um, they have a couple of uh, backups. So I like to keep them kind of separated. And then this I absolutely love as well. It helps keep your um, sponges, washcloths, any of that stuff organized. And it just goes on the back of the door. And as you can see, extremely obscure. So it keeps everything organized, gives you a little bit of extra space and helps keep those things separate that you don't necessarily want touching any of the other stuff inside. So some really good, useful ideas. I will, of course, link all of these things below. They are affordable and have mostly available at Target or Amazon. All right, you guys, that is going to wrap up this kitchen organization and pantry makeover. I hope you guys enjoyed this video as much as I did. As always, I will link everything in the description box down below. Please don't forget to like this video, subscribe to my channel, and hit that post notification bell so you guys can be notified every time I upload new videos. And I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.